Today I'm going to show you how to make this 3D lamb cake. Start by filling the cake pan with about three cups of batter. If you're using a Boughton cake mix, you'll want to reduce the liquid it calls for by a, about a fourth a cup. You'll want the pan to be fairly full and then place the second half of the pan on top with the vent hole up. Place on a cookie sheet and bake. After about 45 to 50 minutes, check the cake by inserting the toothpick into the vent hole. If it comes out clean, it is done. Allow cake to cool in pan for about 5 minutes and then remove from the pan. Allow for cake to cool completely on a cooling rack before decorating. You should leave it laying on its side and not stand it up. Once your cake has completely cooled, you can stand it up and begin decorating. I frosted the face first, wanting it to be somewhat smooth. Then, using a 21 star tip, I decorated the lamb's body by making small swirls of icing. continued with the swirls until the entire lamb's body was covered. Then I dyed a little bit of icing pink to frost small areas for the ear and then for the nose. Then at the end I dyed some icing black and added in the eyes. Add whatever final touches you would like to make your lamb cake complete. I was taking mine to go, so I found a box that would fit this cake perfectly. The cake box had a tray that I put some dyed coconut on. I placed my cake on it and simply slid it in the box, ready to go. And here's my lamb cake, all ready for Easter.